Good evening, everybody, and welcome to stream number five of our Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories, sorry, Rechain of Memories playthrough. Hope everybody's well. Uh, in the previous episode, we completed the 100 Acre Wood minigame section, and um, straight on the back of that, we actually got thrust into a boss fight against Riku, which we... Um, I only had one attempt at because we was right at the end of the stream. So that is where we are going to pick up the action from today, back in Castle Vivian, and um, trying to take on Riku. So without further ado, let's load in. And away we go. All right. Uh, that is the wrong way. Let's get going. Bam. All right, straight into the action. Here we go. Yo, Papyrus is here. What's going on, Papyrus? Hope you are well. Good to see you as always. Doing pretty well. Good to hear, Papyrus. Iron Smeltry's here with the Lurk. What's going on, Iron? Lurk while... Lurk while I displaying? What you displaying? Huh. Alright, I think we're going to have to... Um, well, we'll have a couple more attempts. I'm not going to, like, admit defeat straight away, but we might need to spend a bit of time here um, reviewing our deck and almost creating a buffed up deck. But we'll, we'll see. I broke my heel card. No. No. Wow. Now you learn how much you love the Greek language. You can't produce the language that much, but step by step, you are get you are better. That's good. It's good to hear. Progression's always good, Papyrus. 
Glad to hear that you are indeed progressing. Um, yeah, this, uh, this don't seem to be working. I don't know what sort of build we need, though. That's the thing. This is where I kind of am out, out of my comfort zone. Try like a magic build. Yo, Deathwish with the three year. 36 month resub, my man. Three years of subs. Thank you very much, Deathwish Legend. Good to see you as always. made it past 35 you are old hmm. I don't know why my fire cards and my blizzard cards are set out like differently. Okay, gotta take some healing items here, I guess. Got left, got about another hundred points left. Got about thirty left now. I got no zero cards though, that's the problem with this. Um yeah. Gonna say your name in two ways. That one is Nominative, nominative case and the former case is accusative. It means I am called Papyrus, the latter one means I am Papyrus. Every day is a school day. One of the reasons I love having you on the stream, Papyrus, because I feel like I learned so much from. Uh, I not necessarily like learn directly, but I take so much like in from yourself. Right enough for a Simba. Two points short. 
Two point shot for that. Um, enough for a genie though. We'll use a genie. Okay. And then. On health before the elixirs. Mega Ether before the elixir. Attack cards are there in that order Genie, Boogie, and Card Soldier. <sighs> Let's um, give it a go. guess and um see what we get there at least one attack card in your equip deck that would have been good to know like five minutes ago I've got to bin off one of my other cards. I'm eight points over. No. Okay, can I... I get rid of that I'm bringing a four instead. Uh, and it saves me one point. Okay, so I think I realize why well, there's doubles now. They're the premium cards. Okay. Gotcha. Still don't know what premium cards do, but sure. So if that's the case with that, if I remove that, three, hey, bang on, look, there we go, bang on our 575 mark, that's um, pretty awesome. Awesome. Two uh, seconds. Okay, so now that we've done that, um, let's save. Well, hello. There. hello. You can say that. I used to use the Greek alternative for saying Nick, so those are the ways to say you are called Nicholas or you are called. Nobody calls me Nicholas apart from my mother. <laughs> uh, okay, Nicholas. Please don't. <laughs> You always know you're in trouble if uh, you get called that. Jeez. Uh, Nicholas. Nicholas Scottney. Get over here right now. <laughs> now uh, I, had, I had a cousin named uh, 
mate. Actually. Dude. Unfortunately. There's a bad ending to that story, but not going there. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I just realized. So it's this uh, game you're playing through or replaying through? Uh, it's a playthrough. So, this is the second game in the series. But it's um, basically, um, it's like a card battler. It's really, really very different to the, the previous game. So the way you deal damage and everything is like by use of cards. Ah, oh, shit. That's rude. So it takes like quite a bit more concentration, this one I find. Okay. So I apologize in advance. Come on, Donald, save me. Oh, did I beat him? I beat him. Wow, okay. Nice. I guess all that, all I needed is some American encouragement. Yep, uh, a little good luck coming from my way. Boom, hmm. boom, boom. That and a pure magic build by the scenes, by the looks of it. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. All right, we got an arrow card. Not what arrow does, but... Um, Art obtained. Nice. Let's increase our CP. So to bring you up to speed, um, your you build your decks, but you are I don't know if you have like I've never played card games and card battlers before, but you um, have a certain amount of points. I, I actually, and... just, I actually have a little bit. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's uh, they, yeah, man. I need a. I every time I do that, I got. <laughs> All right. Well, you ever think about? Uh, you ever think about it? And I'm just going to uh, play out this cutscene for a minute. So, uh, yeah, you ever think about what okay. you're going to say? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Riku, please wait. Oh, well, that was um, rather uninvent an uninventful cutscene. Yeah, that what was going to say that Riku like that. Yeah. Better go after Riku. Mm. Gorsh. Gorsh. <laughs> Gorsh. All right. Another cutscene. Riku, where are you? I don't think he's there. Sora? Are you okay? Don't worry about me. Riku, what happened? Hmm, sure was strange. Uh, if you can, like would you mind back. giving me uh, game audio? Again. Yeah, give us a sec. But we got rid of Ansem for good. Eh, yeah, no worries. Then I wonder what is wrong with Riku. Hold on, the kid. If he's with Riku, he might be in danger. Sora? I know. You're thinking Riku isn't your friend. But that's just not true. You sure? 
Well, I know he said some awful things to you back there, but you gotta remember, we are in Castle Oblivion. Why folks lose their memory here a little bit at a time. Rick was probably just forgotten that the two of you were such close friends. That's all. So he just forgot? My guess is that's so. But Sora, instead of being sad, we have to figure out a way to help Riku get his memory back. If we all work together, why, we're sure to get you through this. No need to mope. Jiminy's right. You shouldn't push your friends away. Yeah. Okay. Sora, do you remember our very first promise? Huh? Always smile. smile. That was the promise we made to each other the first time we met. We promise to never forget to keep smiling. You're right. Is that what we promised? I don't remember that. Uh, have you got all the Odith wish or not? Uh, no. Uh, yeah, I was kind of checking my settings. Yeah, I don't, I I don't know if it's yours, though, because like I said, it's because it's capture card. It's not really an application as such, so... Right. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how I can, if I can share it through Discord, unfortunately. Nah. Sorry. Uh, uh, no, yeah. No, no also, um, I ah, saw your problem. message there, Perfurious. Um Speaking of all things uh, podcasty. Uh, me and Deathwish have actually uh, recorded first episode of the Knock uh, the the Knock podcast, the Knockcast. So um, yeah, hopefully uh, that will be uh, able to bring that to you real soon. Once uh, I've got all the editing uh, done and cut all the uh, all of the instances of Deathwish going uh, out of it, which there's a few. <laughs> Yeah, uh, but wait, uh, wait, wait, uh, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so as soon as you're here, Deathwish. Uh, Max, yeah. Uh, as soon as, soon as you're here, genius. Deathwish, pick where we go to next. We can either go to Atlantica, Netherland, or Hollow Bastion. It's not as uh, terrible as Atlantica was in the uh, first game. Gosh, this looks like the bottom of the sea. Sure does. So how can how can we can breathe? Hmm. Beats me. Maybe someone cast a spell on us. Just like Boy. breathing air. But it's not air. See? Boy. Someone's swimming this way. Ariel, what's she doing with the father's trident? I wonder. Like, hiding it behind her back, like, I totally haven't got this, even though it's sticking out like an actual country mile. If anyone asks, she didn't see me. What? Sorry, I don't have time to explain. Just yeah. promise you won't tell. Hey, what's that sparking, sparkling thing you got there? Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. Remember, you didn't see me. I'm not so sure we didn't see you. Well, looked like she was in a hurry. He was hiding something. Wonder what it was.
All righty. The only good thing about this area is the music. Well, the Death Wish can hear it. <laughs> uh, I can un unmute the stream and get the, you know, lovely feedback, but I'll keep it as is. All right, let's go back to deck number two. Yeah. There we go. Still not been the bad, clearly. When we were speaking Absence. earlier on. Yeah, it's been uh, been up since. Uh, uh, math. Maths. Yeah, the math. Too late in the day to be doing math. Maths. Maths with an S. Uh, uh, yeah, okay, so about 32 and a half hours. <laughs> So you've been awake for a little bit then. What are you saying? Yeah, uh, I pretty much woke up yeah. about eight o'clock in the morning uh, yesterday. Sorry. Or Monday. Well, just let me. Um, I don't know. <laughs> let me uh, Discord audio a bit. It's a bit quiet for me. It's my attempt at trying to silence the rambling man. Rambling man who will not be silenced. You cannot silence me. Try as you may. <laughs> People have tried. But never many, have, many have failed. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I will haunt your dreams. And over nightmares. I don't have nightmares. I live a constant, oh, have we... I, I live a constant nightmare. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, have we not met? <laughs> to attack you me, doing is using healing magic. It's annoying. You got ads, Porphyrius. Of course, you want to subtract 1D from that. Otherwise, you're doing mass. Nah. Let's... <laughs> I'm a little bit delusional right now. Oh, really? <laughs> Imagine why. I can't think of a single reason. Heal. 
Oh, is that Mufasa? Simba. Oh, uh, Simba. Yeah, I forgot about Simba. Man, I, I actually watched The Lion King for the first time at Virginia Tech. Uh, was, uh, college. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. I know. Uh, I don't think I've actually seen the anim ever seen the animated uh, Lion King. To be fair, ah, uh, it's a great movie. I have to say, I uh, went to uh, back, back, back then with my then girlfriend. Uh, yeah, it was. Uh, they they have a theater on campus. And they and they shave movies and yeah so went and watched it and i was surprised uh, it was really good yeah i would say definitely definitely tune in and watch it it's, it's a great movie i've not se i've not seen the movie but i've i have been to the um you guys call i'll use your your terminology so you understand um i've been to see the broadway adaptation of it oh, which was oh. uh pretty good well you got me beat on that i've only ever seen you know the, the movie so never seen the broadway production i don't just see the broadway production broadway is in new york well, that's why I'm using American terminology because if I just if I had turned around to you and said I've seen the West the West End show, you'd have been like, okay, gotcha. What? <laughs> so yeah, that's why I'm using American terminology. Ah, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're a step ahead of me, like always. Once I'm a step ahead of you, I'm just um, five hours ahead of you. Not as delusional. <laughs> so so yeah so. Five, at least five steps ahead of me, at, at least. Power. Each hour is a step. Yeah. yeah. Oh, more air boats. Boom. Oh, let's see if anybody. Oh, uh, this is oh, this is perfect timing. Really? Courage. Oh, I'm worried. Heal. Fire. Yep. All right, we got a ten dollar. Airboat competition going on in chat, guys. You know what to do. Get your uh, airboat guesses in. Yeah, it's funny how people don't like to type a few numbers in to even have a chance. I don't think it's so much that. I, mean, I think it's also a case that, you know, there's probably not that many people in my chat as well, so. <laughs> Poor Ferris with the nice guess. I'm not saying if it's right or not, because uh, that would kind of give it away. Give it away, give it away, give it away now. See, I don't think you've got that many. I think you're substantially lower than that, so I'm going to say you've got 50, 50, yeah, 50, yeah, 56,832. You, my friend, are wrong. What? I will say you are closer 
than Mr. Porphyrius. Oh. I'm closer than Mr. Porphyrius. Yes, indeed, sir. Something useful, Donald. Stop healing me. <laughs> Though I know technically healing me is use useful, but when I want you to attack the enemies, it's not very helpful. Not using American terms. Thanks, it's rare. Usually, you both have a huge debate on the thing. Oh, well, yeah. interesting when you say that. <laughs> may have debated the differences between American and English thing. Hashtag spoiler coming up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's plenty more to talk about. Well, we'll save that for another time. Wait, there's going to be another time? Uh, well, that's up to you. I mean, you're, you're the... Commander in chief. Please. No pressure then. Yeah. Yep, no pressure. Freeze. Why do you uh, fight with a big key? That's the key blade. Yeah, it's kind of weird, I think. Yeah. Yeah, well, the Keyblade is the um, is what you need to uh, seal all of the doors to darkness where the Heartless come from, so... Okay, couldn't you have a key in your back pocket? And use, like, uh, I don't know, a crossbow, a bazooka, shotgun, rocket turret, sword, I mean, anything else. With the key, keep the key in your pocket until you need it. I mean, that, that wouldn't be ex as exciting, though, let's be honest. Who invited all these guys to the party? Seriously. Uh, I guess you're kind of like a... You're like a key logger. Key logger. <laughs> uh... I'm sure I'd go for a key logger. Okay. <laughs> well, you're kind of chopping things. Not wood, but you're using your key to chop enemies, so kind of like a logger, but just no wood. Ah, well, well, that depends on where you hit him. Yeah, <laughs> Gibby. Yeah, I'm not really sure I'd call it uh, a logger like a lumberjack, that's for sure. <laughs> They say a number under 60,000, but then you thought that you hadn't been here <laughs> many hours and you assume that Deathwish had been here way more. Uh, to be fair, I think you've probably been here more than Deathwish recently. Yeah. Curious, so. He, yeah. He's, he's deceived I've, I've you. I've been kind of. Keeping a low profile. Yes. That's, that's, that's the thing. That's what I do. I'm, keep a low I'm profile. trying to keep things mixed up. Yeah, I, I just, I've either been out of town or I've been asleep. Uh, er, 808, er, and <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I, I think 
many times I've, I've simply just not been awake for the streams until yeah after they were over. So uh, I would wake up and go, oh, it's eight o'clock, which you know your time it's one o'clock and for furious it's two o'clock if i recall correctly so, uh, uh, no you think you might be an hour out there on Papyrus this time oh so, yeah he's seven hours ahead to me yeah yeah he's two two from me yeah i was gonna say uh five you're five for me, and he's seven for me. So yeah, yeah. Dad, it, it it actually dawned on me great when I said it. So, but uh, crazy how that works. How many time zones do you have in the UK? Just one. Oh, uh, we we have four. All right, no need to brag. <laughs> the thing is, Aaron, I don't know if I've told this story before, but it's really quite bizarre because although we only have one time zone, um, I mean, I'm a bit like you in America. I'm, I'm East Coast, right? Um, yeah. So when, when I went over to Ireland a few years ago, um, they're obviously as west pretty much as west as you can go um went to a place called uh, limerick and i went Scot out scotland no ireland ireland not scotland yeah. <laughs> um but yeah i, I sort of went out like in the okay well here's the answer since... from i'm sorry to interrupt the rambling man you carry on buddy Courage. give us the answer 60,006. Okay, so, um, to go back to my story, um, what's I say? I'm basically East Coast. When I went to Ireland, I went to, like, on the West Coast, effectively. But because of the difference from, like, East Coast to West Coast, it was really bizarre. I went outside at, like, um, I think it was like half past eight in the morning. Where here in winter, it would be light. It gets light sort of like, I don't know, half past seven, quarter to eight sort of time here in the winter. But we're still like absolutely pitch black at like half past eight time in Ireland. Because they're like completely. Because it's like so far. I think they must be like so far away from the uh, GMT line sort of thing. Um. I almost feel like for Ireland they should have a their own separate time zone. But anyway, I think I, I don't feel like I articulated uh, that particularly well. So I apologise. Uh, hey, you're good. I started the story and then I kind of just completely forgot what I was trying to say halfway through. Uh, Oh, no, no, what's funny is, you know, the, the saying, at least on the internet, is, you know, uh, Americans think 100 years is a long time and Europeans think 100 miles is a long way. Yeah. Uh, that, that fits that perfectly because, like, even my state is, like, Virginia is wider at the longest point. By far than the UK. Oh yeah. So yeah, to drive from East Coast to Father's West Coast of Virginia would, would take you about six hours. Yeah. Uh, at least, yeah. Uh, depending on how. Faster drive. 
We see that's the other yeah, thing. It's like over here. I mean, I, I don't interstate know. and going seventy. Yeah, I mean, you're spinning all day. And do you have um, do you have speed limits on the in states on the freeways or? Oh yeah, yeah. Is it just me, or are you like really delayed? Are you watching? So like, over here, the... uh, dead I, stop, uh, stop, stop, well, stop, 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 stop. Are you listening to me on the stream or something? Because you are very delayed in answering my questions and replying to me. <laughs> okay, hold on. You're like insanely delayed. It's ridiculous. Well, I only... Okay, how about now? I don't know, because I haven't said anything yet. You just did. I'm saying something now. Yes. Mm, well, it's better than it was, I guess. Yeah, I mean, trying to hold um, a conversation with you a ago was impossible. I was wondering what was going on. I mean, yeah, so to, um, to, and to go back to what I said, it's like, do you guys have um, speed limits on like your freeways and stuff, or is it just like drive however you want, drive however fast you want to drive? Uh, speed limits, hundred percent. We don't have an autobahn or anything like that. It's pretty much residential is 25 miles an hour. Uh, typically commercial or industrial areas is 35. Okay. And and like uh, side side roads or depending on how how many houses or you know that sort of thing uh it, it, it could be 35 to 45 and then highways are typically 55 um interstates can be anywhere from 60 65 to 70 in Virginia anyway some states uh, there, there's some states in the Midwest where there's very little traffic to have long flat roads that have a speed limit but they don't really enforce it so it's kind of like the Autobahn okay and yeah, I mean, but yeah, in general, what what I said was pretty much how it is in every state. Uh, some states have higher limits. Like the fastest we used to have when I was growing up was 55 miles per hour. Yeah, for those for those that are from your side of the world. We, we, kilometers. Uh, you say you say that, but we we're in miles now here. So yeah, okay. So, yeah. Then we like as things changed over the years, and and things got more populated and more traffic. Uh, speed limits went up. Yep. Yeah. And it's still 55 on your typical highway, but interstates are typically at least 65. And sometimes 70 now, which 
I used to only see in other states. Like if, like if I'm on Interstate 95, which runs from north to south, the whole East Coast of America, pretty much. Like it, it goes the whole way, all the way down to the end of Florida. Okay. And uh, it, uh, depending on what state you're in, like you'll go from Virginia, it could be 65, and then you get to North Carolina, and it's 70. So it varies. But, uh, another difference is. Uh, it varies by state uh, how uh, how many miles an hour ever you can drive without getting pulled over and given a ticket. Okay. Yep. So, like, and and it's completely. The thing is, it's completely up to the cop. Yes. And, and it's different for state troopers as opposed to who, who can be anywhere in the state and give you a ticket for anything. And then your local county sheriff's deputies, they, they like if if you go across the county line and they're behind you, they can no longer do anything. Yes. Okay. So yeah, uh, but they they typically are kind of the same. Some some are complete a holes, and well, I mean they, they, most of them will typically give you at minimum five over and that's yes. and that's being that's being harsh because you know speedometers their, their radar has to be calibrated on a regular basis and that sort of thing yeah some some will some will go 10 miles an hour over anything more i'm gonna pull you kind of thing uh, so, yeah, it, it, it just completely depends. So you kind of have to learn if you want to get somewhere faster, you have to have been, you, you have to learn yeah. what the, what the rules are, so to speak, for the areas you're in. Okay. Cause I've been, I've been pulled over for many times <laughs> when I was younger. I haven't been pulled over in a long, long time now. Things change when you get older. Uh, but, but yeah. Yeah, my ass to me, yeah. Uh, Doctress is here. What's going on, Doctress? How you doing? Doctor, oh, hey, Doctress. Hello, I'm here. Twitch didn't notify me. Ah, oh, hey, Del uh, <laughs> hey, Delphus. <laughs> hey, Doctress. Ah, uh, sorry, you're uh, down. What's going on, man? To... Yeah, the only, the only reason I asked that question about the, um, about the speed limits and stuff was because of the, um, the bike you actually identify, like uh, the Autobahn in Germany is kind of like no speed limit at all, um, which is quite crazy. Well, but that's weirdly, only on certain sections there. Weirdly enough, like the, we, we have like a 70 miles an hour limit on dual carriageways and um, motorways. But when it was introduced, it was only actually meant to be like a temporary um, thing. It wasn't actually like meant to stay at 70 miles an hour, which I find quite interesting. Do y'all have uh, tolls? Uh, yeah, we got to, we have got toll rolls, yep. Okay. Uh, so how much are your, like, is your average toll? Like, what's um, the cheapest? 
What's the most expensive? Uh, I can't tell you because I don't actually have any toll roads near where I live, so... But I mean, you live over there. Uh, I haven't gone through the most expensive ones around on the East Coast, but I know how much they... Well, I know how much they were, like, 20 years ago, and it was freaking ridiculous. But yeah, originally, at least here, tolls were supposed to be to pay for the road, even though the roads were paid for by tax money. Mm -hmm. But but they're trying to like recoup that, I guess you could say. With the toes, and it's also well, they say it's for upkeep, maintenance, and all that kind of stuff, you know. And it's like, yeah, okay. So, originally, like the ones that are close to me used to be 25 cents, now they're 75 cents. Uh, okay. Well, from what I know, what little I do know about toll roads in the UK, they ain't that cheap. Freeze. I'll, um... Uh, uh, yeah. Well, I mean... This is... I used... You know, when you go through them, which I did, like, uh, eight... eight miles. So, like, driving ten minutes. Had to pay a dollar fifty a day. Yeah, Which, no, not, not, not crazy. But now you go up further north from me to uh, the bridges. Uh, you could look on a map of the Potomac River uh, going from Virginia to, say, Maryland. Yeah. And it. it, it I don't know. It used to be like way back in the day. It was like eight, nine dollars, ten dollars. I forget. I think there, there's plenty that are like sixteen bucks just to cross a bridge. I mean, I wouldn't say it's crazy. That, I wouldn't say like that much. I mean, hold on. Just let me just let me check. Let me have a quick look. Uh, let me pause YouTube. 